Okay guys, uh, I'm making this video because I think Steps is now a little bit better for scouting than it was before. They altered this map in many, uh, many ways, in many subtle ways. But uh, I want to show you that I think that uh, this hill is not as good as uh, a lot of enemy players over there think it might be and that the this scouting uh, run in this area with a retreat and then a repeat rinse and repeat uh, is very productive uh, but it's an urgent matter that you do it as quickly as possible before people get into position you've got to uh, reveal their movements uh, before they have uh, settled down in a bush or something after which it's uh, after which point it's much more difficult to light them up and you'll see here that uh, I'm in a light tank and they put me in the back row uh, at the start of the fight. I I've been raging about that uh, forever and I even sent them a ticket uh, once saying, uh, you know, put the light vehicles in the front row so that they do not have to uh, struggle to get out of the spawn and uh, onto their assignments. Uh, uh, you know, uh, why subject me to a traffic jam at the start? Anyways, I'm going to hit the space bar here and I'll show you uh, what I think is good uh, from my perspective about this map now. So watch, I have to get past this Progetto. See, uh, this has already imposed a short delay. I I'm two or three seconds late. You know, every second counts. I've got to get up there as quick as I can. So we'll just see this. So you use this reverse slope, the first one. Then there's a second one just ahead of you. And there's even a third one just ahead there. Okay, the TVP is moving into position, and he's been detected. That's not good for him, and hopefully we'll get some guns going here. So I back off, and there's the STA. Uh, the STA won the Tier 8. So, And I wasn't spotted. You always back off the split second. And Jim uh, in the Scorpion G just landed a hit on him. Now I see the ammo. And remarkably, the ML2 didn't see me. Uh, this vehicle is it definitely has the best camouflage of any vehicle I've ever driven in World of Tanks. There's no doubt about that. It's been proven over and over again. Okay, this is this is a point I wanted to make. You'll see that uh, there's people here on the hill. Uh, they're on one level. The ML2 has ducked down. So in a sense. Uh, their fighting power is is disconnected uh, one from the other and I'm able to do stuff because of that fact and I'll show you so I'm just gonna hit the space bar ahead because the ammo's gone downstairs I can go back for more and try to get lights there and uh, spotted the scout there and, and I'll just say right off the back I think that position is garbage for scouting I've never used it SDA2 lit again. And he just got uh, hit by the 268. Now, the ammo is still downstairs, right? And, and the OHO as well, which means I can go back again and relight people. And then retreat on the level behind the 268. And I've always almost got... I've already got 1755. And... You know, I, I do like playing chicken with people. I, I do like the challenge of uh, luring that OHO and trusting in my driving ability and uh, uh, ability just to come within a few feet of getting hit, but not too close. So he's reloading there. And there, the 268 just took him out. Now I'll do my same maneuver again. Because, like I said, the Emil is down there, and these guys are, are hiding. So I'm, you know, it's beautiful. And you couldn't do this before. It was different. I think the sight lines were, are, are more blocked now here. And as a scout, you always want, uh, you want any kind of reverse slope to, to uh, allow you to uh, withdraw uh, in cover. So I just relit these guys, and we'll see how it goes. Uh at this stage, I'm very unhappy that this this huge force here has not uh, uh, made a move. Uh, we've got a, a 
a huge amount of fighting power that is uh, being blocked by an inferior force. Now, um, I don't know the sight lines precisely, but it could be that they they can't they feel they can't advance this way because the Emil will uh, peek out and pop them. Uh, he's a tier nine, very he's got a clip. Uh, so I don't know precisely, but uh, I'm never happy with uh, that kind of a situation. So I'm gonna go back up and hope for there. There I just got spotting damage on on that guy. So I look at that. I got hit twice by the TVP, who is now obviously. Uh, in concealment up there, but uh, I survived. And uh, I'll point out one more thing before I end the video here. The ammo is uh, quite rightly is trying to escape. Uh, good players know when to get out of dodge, so that's a smart move. And there's the TVP who is not the TVP you know, is and not acting in a court. At the moment the ammo runs, he should run too. And and you know, the TVP is awfully fast. So he could have he could have fallen back and and got into a, a better firing position. And he should have done it about uh, 40 or 50 seconds ago. But he made a mistake and uh, did not read the play. And he already just hit the. Uh, And that, there's another guy, right? He also is fast. He also could see what was happening. He also had an opportunity to withdraw and did not do so. So he's going to suffer that. He, it's out of the question for him to get away now. So uh, there, I just saw the arty. So, um, you know, I've got 2730 spawning damage. Uh, it's good enough. You know, it's not spectacular. This is not Malinovka. This is not Prokhorovka. But it uh, makes a, a contribution to the battle, and it speeds things along always. And uh, any scout that doesn't do more or less what I did in this situation is not doing his job. And uh, uh, if you don't want to act aggressively right at the start, uh, get in a different tank. Anyways, it's it, it, it's largely game over. These guys, uh, uh, you know, they, they had a huge force over here that's uh, uh, fight. You know, it's it's not encountering anything. We're concentrated. Uh, they lost people here that they uh, they ought not to have lost because they they didn't retreat properly, and it's game over. They can't possibly recover. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video.